Hello everybody, and welcome to Ancient Architects. Please subscribe now to get the latest ancient history news and independent research from around the world. The timeline of ancient Egyptian history is often debated by researchers, especially concerning the monuments on the Giza Plateau and whether they are Old Kingdom or pre-dynastic. The debate will linger forever, but a new discovery in the Sinai Desert is certainly pre-dynastic, dating back to at least 10,000 BC, and it gives us an insight into the lives of the people who lived in this region in very ancient times. The rock art was discovered by a person who was exploring caves in the desert of South Sinai, roughly 40 miles southeast of Serebit el Kadim and 20 miles north of St. Catherine. According to the Secretary General of the Supreme Council of Antiquities, the inscriptions are located in a difficult region to access called Al Zarinij, and were discovered in a large sandstone rock shelter approximately 10 feet high and 20 feet wide. It is thought that this cave was frequented by nomadic Bedouin as a shelter, and they were responsible for the artwork that is found on the roof of the cave as well as blocks of stone that had fallen to the floor. Talking to Egypt Today, Hisham Hussein, head of the archaeological mission, said that the discovered inscriptions depict many different scenes dating back to different eras. They are a dark reddish colour, and whilst many are still quite visible to the naked eye, a lot of them have faded. Experts have divided the cave art into three distinct categories, based on their content and style. The first type dates to between 7,000 and 12,000 years ago, and are primarily found on the ceiling of the cave. The images include animals such as donkeys and mules, and are drawn in a realistic way and are in proportion. Interestingly, there are also handprints all over the cave from the same era. You can also find ancient handprints in the western desert of Egypt, but the hands that are found in Sinai are of a different style and are thought to be much later in date. The second type of rock art dates between 3500 and 2300 BC, the Chalcolithic period or Copper Age, and are described as stick-like images of females and animals. They are not as commonly found inside the cave, and, in style, they are more abstract than accurate. The third and final type shows people on a howdah, a type of bed or carriage that is carried by a camel and is used to transport members of the elite. Experts estimate that these images date to some time in the first millennium BC. Finding rock art in Egypt isn't actually uncommon, but the latest finds will help researchers to better understand the ancient history of Sinai. The group of archaeologists are now surveying a larger area as more ancient rock drawings are thought to be hiding inside the desert. Thank you very much for watching this news update from Ancient Architects. If you enjoyed the video, please subscribe to the channel, please like the video, and please leave a comment below. Thank you very much.